Hey guys, Zach from Miller from Metalhead Couple here, and welcome back to another video. Today we are doing Metalhead Myths Part 2. Let's continue from where we left off. Metal is bad for children. Now, depends on the child. If the child is well informed about everything, then yeah, it can be just, it's not a bad influence. Just tell them, hey, you know, music isn't like stuff you should be doing. Uh, but if the child's very, very, uh, influenced by everything, then don't let them listen to metal. Because it can cause problems. But it being inherently bad for children is not necessarily true. I could think of pop songs that are worse for children than some of the metal I listen to. Metal takes no talent. Now this is a bunch of bullshit. I'm still working on how to do death metal, uh, death metal growls, and I mean, I'm doing pretty good, but it did take me training. It took me months to finally get the screams kind of proper, and I'm still trying to train so I can do them perfectly and longer. When metal takes, uh, no, people say metal takes no talent, it's a bunch of bullshit, because some is actually singing, like, you've got people who can actually sing somberly, sing great, sing fast, but it sounds good. Metal takes talent, motherfuckers. All of metal is screaming. Not necessarily, there's three different, there's four different forms according to me. I list them as, sorry, the camera seems to be a bit off, but I don't think it is, so I'm not gonna screw with it. But, um, um, Metal has four forms. Regular or fast singing, which is one form. Growling, screaming, and shrieking. Shrieking is like what you'd imagine a banshee does. Screaming is more of, um, Slayer vocals. Slayer or possibly Anthrax at times. Um, regular singing is done by a lot of metal bands, Metallica, Megadeth, uh, growling is like your cannibal corpse, your bloodbath, them. Here's one. I know we already covered, um, we have not covered racism yet, but here's our first little, um, jump into it. Metal is only for white people. Now, I see where this myth stems from. A lot of bands are typically only, well... The, the, the biggest one is only, metal is only for white men, but I put people because, yeah, I've seen it. Um, but it's like, yeah, metal isn't just for white people. There are people who are metal who are, uh, Latin, Mexican, um, Spanish, British, Australian, New Zealander, there's metal. Metal is a universal thing. Anybody can do it. It just takes practice and talent. And it isn't just inherently for one group. Now you'll try to get those uh, purists who are like, oh, metal is only for white people. White, you, you got your like white power people. And it's stupid because all this is is skin. Everything else is the same. Everything else is like a blueprint. The only thing that's different is what color paint you have with it. And we enter the last one on our list. Metal is for drunk, uh, or metalheads are drunks. Yes and no, because you'll have those people who only drink at shows, you'll have those people who constantly drink, or you got the people who are totally sober. No, not all metalheads are drunks. You have drunks in everything. You have them in pop, you have them in country, you have them in rap, you have them in R&B, you have them in uh, probably emo music, I don't know. I'll listen to it as well. I was honest, if you have them in rock, there's some pretty infamous ones. But, one thing that perpetuated it was uh, Dave Mustaine, uh, and the reason he was booted from Metallica being a heavy drinker, and was a very, he got angry when he drank, with the thing. He drank when he was angry, so it only perpetuated his anger more. Now, um, now sometimes you might have somebody drinking on stage or something, but it, sometimes it's very little, sometimes it's a lot. But for the most part, it's, uh, 
But we're not drunks. We're just listening to metal while being drunk. I've heard is like so interesting. So yeah, that one is. All the ones on here are false, but do have some um, truth behind them. The no talent one is the only one that pisses me off because metal does take talent. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and a comment. Check out the links for the music used along with my band's Instagram and um, my Amino page. Other than that, I hope to see you guys in the next video. And sorry about no video yesterday. That's why I uploaded two. Bye bye!